President Donald Trump's tax plan is being billed by the White House and Republicans as a boon for the middle class. But wealthy Americans, including Trump himself, stand to benefit handsomely from the tax proposal, thanks to provisions eliminating the estate tax and the alternative minimum tax, AMT, among others. Exactly how much individuals save will depend on many factors, and as business insiders Josh Barrow pointed out, Tax cuts for average Americans aren't likely to be as sweeping as Republicans make it sound. Some analysts think the current plan will have to be scaled back considerably, since it would reduce federal government revenue by an estimated, and unsustainable, $5.8 billion over 10 years. Still, as it stands now, take home pay could increase for most Americans under Trump's tax plan. We were curious how it might change. So we ran some numbers using the current proposal, and filling in the gaps with details from Trump's candidate tax plan. Single, childless taxpayer, $25,000, salary $13,000, standard deduction personal exemption taxable income approximate federal taxes owed potential federal tax savings current system Trump tax single, childless taxpayer. $75,000 salary $350,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450,450
given the trouble Trump has faced in his attempts to overhaul the U.S. healthcare system. As the conversation around tax reform continues to unfold, there are a couple important points to help understand how the plan could affect the average American taxpayer not just high-earning Wall Street pros. The majority of Americans do not itemize tax deductions. According to the most recent IRS analysis of individual tax returns, 70.4% of taxpayers claim the standard deduction on their tax return. Americans who do claim the standard deduction will be able to reduce their taxable income further under Trump's tax plan in turn reducing their tax bill. Single filers would deduct $12,000, slightly higher than the current combined $10,400 deduction, which includes the standard deduction and one personal exemption. Joint filers would deduct $24,000, up from the current $20,800, which includes the standard deduction and two personal exemptions. But, Trump's tax plan would do away with many deductions which could increase federal taxes for Americans who itemize their deductions. Among those who do, the average claimed for 2014 was $27,447. The U.S. does not have a flat tax, federal income taxes are calculated on a progressive basis. If your income falls into the 25% bracket, you don't give the federal government 25% of your income. That would be a flat tax, the type of tax reform favored by Ted Cruz, but it isn't how our current progressive tax system operates. Here's how the most basic calculation works, something you probably learned in high school government class and then quickly forgot, for a single taxpayer who will not itemize their deductions in 2017 colon figure out your taxable income, annual salary, deductions. Exemption S. Everyone pays 10% federal income tax on their first $9,325 of taxable income. Everyone pays 15% federal income tax on their next $9,326 to $37,950 of taxable income. Everyone pays 25% federal income tax on their next $37,951 to $91,90. 